Hi, Dyslexic Genius here, Brett Hurt. What I'm going to talk about is polishing out a bed plate and cleaning a, an enameled black bed plate on an Edison or any of the Edison cylinder players. And you can do this in the machine, but you'll have to take the surrounding wood off to, to cover it. Some have them, some don't. First, you need to clean the bed plate. This is half has been done, half has not. You can see this is all corroded. The decal disappeared under the dirt and junk. Well, how you do this is first I coat it with my fingers with goop and I let it sit for a little bit. And then I use four out steel wool. But what I'm going to do is I'm not going to push hard on it. I'm going to gently go like this. And when you do it softly, you can feel this decal when the steel wool goes over it. You can, literally, you can feel it. And you want to watch the striping on the side. But before you start, you can see here where I haven't cleaned, the striping's missing. Nice, shiny, bad, bad, bad. Then it comes down here, we have a nice line. And then here, and then here it gets worn off. And after you've done the goop, I wipe it off with a paper towel that's damp. I wipe everything off and then I dry it with another paper towel. After you've done that part... But why do you have paper towels shoved in that hole? I'm protecting the governor and the running parts here. I don't want to get goop in here. So I cover everything up. You can stick them in here, but if you're careful, the goop won't go in here. You just have to be careful. <laughs> then I use Meguiar's automotive products because I like them. And this is a fine cut rubbing compound. You don't want to use a coarse cut because if you use coarse cut, it's going to eat up your decals and your striping. After you've done that, you pour some on, a little bit on. You take a towel. I use old t-shirts and you just start rubbing it in, getting the edges like this. Gently on the, on the decals. You can watch it when you're doing it. After that, I buff it off with another piece of t-shirt. And then I repeat with Meguiar's Clean and Wax. And after you're done, this is what your bed plate will look like. You will have like this scuff mark. This is an original marking in it. This won't come out. But if you look at it, all the decals came out, all the striping. These early ones were striped and put on with decals. You know, you can do this with any machine. You just have to be very careful when you're doing it. And you don't want to go real hard on it when you're rubbing. Everything's gentle. And then once you get it polished out, you're going, wow, that's really cool. I got 10 more Edisons in the house. I guess I'm going to do those over Thanksgiving to get away from the fam. <laughs> you know, this hobby is a lot of fun. I like to make a few jokes once in a while. And that's my tip for the day.